In this video, what we're going to be discussing is how do you adjust a real lawnmower for its major height adjustments, which is reorienting the cutting blades in relationship to the wheel to get to a lower cutting height. One thing to remember on American lawnmower reels, this can only be done on the 16, 18, and 20 inch reels. This feature is not available on your 14 inch reels. So before you purchase, visit our website at AmericanLawnmower.com and that'll give you more details on the cutting heights that are available on the different reels. First, what you wanna do, if your model has it, is pop off the cover. That's gonna expose the bolt and the E-ring holding on the wheel. What you simply want to do is take your flathead screwdriver, find your opening, pop it right off. Now with that, you can just take your wheel off. So just give a little push and your wheel comes right on off. Okay, now that we've taken the wheels off, we, you can now see the side plate and the adjustment. Here we have it's set at C. This is the highest cutting height. This is how it's set at the factory. The middle is B and the lower is A. So what we have to do now is take off the axle so we can pivot the plate and realign everything. You'll have your 11 32nd and your half inch. So go ahead, lock it in place, and go in there and take off your axle. And remember, this gets done on both sides. Okay, now that we have the axle off, we can set it to our height. Each one of these corresponds with different cutting heights, along with your back adjusters. C, like I said, this is set at the factory. These are your highest cutting heights. You rotate the plate, that's B. That gets you the next level of cutting heights. And then A, that gets you the lowest cutting heights. So as you can see, you move your side plate based upon this, it automatically relines up your axle into a hole where you just can then reinsert your axle and get that tightened. And remember, when you do this, it has to be the exact same on the other side. Go in there, you'll get that all tight. Then you move over to the other side and do the exact same thing of removing the axle, rotating the plate up, then retightening the axle back into position. Now that you've done both sides and you reset your reel now, it's a simple now reassemble, which is you get your wheel, slide that back on, you get your E-ring, do that, snap it back on, put your wheel cover, once again, you've got the other wheel on, slide your other wheel back on, get your E-ring set, and put your hub on. So, now what you've done is you've taken your reel mower from the highest setting to the lowest setting. Now, if you have any other questions about major and minor cutting heights, visit us at AmericanLawnMower.com and you'll be able to find some other helpful videos on adjusting your reel mower.